Okay, this is Roddy here on um, April 20th, uh, 2023, for the reporting for the Quacks Engine Forum. And we're going to try to get a an engine running here. It's a Cox 049 Baby B. A little bit modified with an external tank, but other, other than that, uh, nothing different. Uh, the needle has a, um, a silicone seal to, to try to help against air leakage. And there is a flywheel on the crankshaft rather than a propeller. And I am going to show you my muffler design and we're going to try to get a reading uh, with and without the muffler to see how much uh, noise, if any, is reduced by using it. Um, I'm going to show you now how easy it is to use this muffler that, I, that I've designed here and it just basically pushes on and pulls off. That's it. It pushes on and covers the exhaust ports of the uh, cylinder and pulls off. Obviously this fits better on a, on a reed valve engine than it would be uh, for a front rotary valve engine because of the in air intake. But I'm working on that. So um, without further ado, I'm going to... I've already filled the tank um, with uh, SIG uh, SIG gl Glow Fuel for um, half A and I'm going to use an electric starter to try to light the fire here and I also have this Ralph Cooney throttle um, which works with the Venturi in the back after you remove the screen from the motor, but we'll get to that later. Now the second wants to run. A little flooded maybe. But I like it because the starter doesn't force it. I actually have this set for a counter for a clockwise rotation so it doesn't loosen the prop screw. Bear with me here. We're switching starters because uh, I have a little issue with my with this starter um, that I just made. I have to. All right, this is my old starter, which works really well here. Okay, there you go. <laughs> it's a lot quieter. <laughs> 